Bernie Sanders, the senator from Vermont, ran a strong campaign against Hillary Clinton in order to try to gain the nomination from the Democratic Party for the 2016 presidential election. Although he was unable to gain the nomination, he ran a strong campaign and brought many issues to the forefront. But his controversial stance on the funding of military weapons and funding and supporting the military industrial complex has been a difficult one for him. Let's go ahead and look at it. Taking a look at Bernie Sanders' Facebook page, I saw that he had over 4,500,000 likes and he was supporting progressive movements like stopping the Dakota Access Pipeline. On the Political Magazine website, I was reading an article about the defense industry and I came upon a chart called Fall of Defense Money. And it was interesting to see that Bernie Sanders had raised more in the presidential election than Republican candidates. Visiting the fortune.com site, I saw an article that talked about Sanders and saying how he had supported extremely costly programs like the $400 billion F-35 Joint Strike Fighter. Bernie Sanders supported the F-35 fighter jet, which was a $1 trillion program to create a fighter jet. It seemed every website I opened, a pattern was establishing. It was showing that Bernie Sanders claimed to be the progressive in the 2016 presidential election was actually the one who was raising more money from the defense industry than his Republican counter. It's just hard to imagine how a progressive liberal candidate like Bernie Sanders would support major uh, military industrial complex projects and has never once stood against any defense industry related bill that would support military funding for the creation of more weapons. Going to the opensecrets.org website, I discovered the top 20 recipients of the defense industry in the 2015 to 2016 cycle. Number one, a familiar name, Hillary Clinton. But the second name on there was very interesting. Bernie Sanders, a Democrat, in the Senate, $410,000. Thank all of you for being part of the political revolution. Nominee for president. Bernie Sanders conceding his loss in the Democratic Party nomination for 2016 election showed that he was not willing to fight against a system like he claimed he was. If he was so progressive and so liberal, why was he giving up his supporters and his campaign funding to Hillary Clinton, who was more of a centrist candidate? 